as we do. Crocodiles have a fascinating but brutal way of killing their prey, starting with the infamous death roll, the terrifying spinning maneuver to subdue and dismember whatever they're about to eat. It may seem barbaric, but crocodiles have to break down their prey into smaller, easily digestible chunks before feasting on them. They're vicious to almost all animals of the jungle, but on rare occasions, crocodiles have to retreat back to their lake after being defeated by their prey. Here are 10 times crocodiles messed with the wrong animal and got absolutely owned. Number 10. Elephants Crocodile attacks on elephants are common when populations of elephants live near the river. Even though elephants are mostly gentle giants, you don't want to get on their bad side. They can get severely aggressive if they're sick, injured, or harassed. These elephants were chilling by the watering hole, and then out of nowhere a crocodile jumped out at them clearly out for some blood. Too bad the elephants teamed up together and the croc was pushed back into his lake. From the looks of it, it seems like elephants really don't like crocodiles. This crocodile out here getting mercilessly stomped on by one didn't survive this attack. Number 9. Hippos Hippos are much stronger than crocodiles, with a bite force of 1,800 psi. That means they crush a crocodile with just one bite. Their skins are so thick that they're literally bulletproof too. So when a hippo ends up in a duel with a crocodile, it's not hard to guess the winner. This one is just brutal. It's one crocodile against dozens of hippos. We don't usually root for crocodiles, but this one's totally outnumbered. Doesn't stand a chance. This wildebeest was left for dead. It was surely a goner. But then these hippos stepped in and saved him from being turned into crocodile lunch. Oh, they are <laughs> wow. Number 8. Tigers Here's a fun fact. All recorded events of crocodiles fighting on land have resulted in tigers killing them. And even when it's in the waters, crocodiles stand little chance against the biggest members of the cat family. Here we witness an epic scene in which a tiger takes on a 14 foot long crocodile. The tiger is seen calculating its attack point behind the crocodile before jumping it. It tries to wear the reptile down. The crocodile instead keeps flailing around. Eventually, we see it get tired and stop struggling. Here, it's three tigers against one crocodile. A rig match, but okay. Before anything can happen, the crocodile is intimidated into retreating back into the water. If they wanted to, they could have gone into the water too. Number 7. Lions Despite the crocodile's long, imposing jaws, it's proven that lions are always able to take down crocodiles on land. But when it comes to the water, crocodiles have the upper hand. Crocodiles also have a much stronger bite force than lions, so it's always a tough match between the two. This one starts off with one and then two more lions coming in for backup and all of them viciously attack the crocodile at once. It was hardly a fair match, but that's how it goes in the jungle. Oh, yeah. Here we see an entire pride of lions against one crocodile. The lions were busy enjoying their meal. The crocodile just swam by, trying to see what's going on, and they all glared at the poor thing with so much hate that it backed off and went the other way. Don't mind me, just passing through. Again, there's a whole family of lions and one poor crocodile. It doesn't show fear though and bravely holds its ground. Number 6. Baboons 
If there's one thing baboons are afraid of, it's being in the water. An entire horde of them has it out for this one crocodile in particular because it tried to grab and drag one of them down into the water with it and make a meal of it. The water was quite shallow and baboons are a lot stronger than you'd think, so the one attacked made it out okay. Maybe the crocodiles would be more successful if they decided to hunt in packs from now on. Baboons are mostly opportunistic eaters, but sometimes they also eat meat. This crocodile made the mistake of underestimating its opponent. What probably happened here is the crocodile thought the baboon would be an easy target and wouldn't put out much of a fight, but boy was he wrong. The baboon dished out just as much as the crocodile was trying to throw its way. Number 5. Buffaloes A crocodile's jaw can apply 5,000 pounds of pressure per square inch, so a clumsy little buffalo stands almost no chance against the beast. But that doesn't mean they always get defeated. This crocodile caught the buffalo from its chin and its jaws are firmly shut. The buffalo struggles to free itself. Thankfully, the other buffaloes were around and the crocodile knew it'd lose if it persisted and ran back. Buffaloes can run at a speed of up to 35 miles per hour, but this one chose to slowly walk away when it knew it was being watched by the crocodile who wants to eat it and is thinking about just how it's going to do that. The buffalo doesn't even look bothered, it just gets out of the water and walks away. But if it wanted, it could have chosen to run too. Buffaloes often appear gentle, but don't be fooled. This uninterested buffalo goes by this crocodile. The next one, however, sends the reptile flying, using its horns and literally shoves the crocodile aside. Number 4. Wildebeest Wildebeest stay in herds, even when they take naps. Some of the others watch guard to prevent predators, like crocodiles, from sneaking up on them and eating them. So it's no surprise they often end up defeating their predators. The wildebeest put up a good fight, and it walked out of the water alive, but wounded. Oh, he did it! <laughs> Had this wildebeest not been blessed with such sharp reflexes and dodged the crocodile, it would have been dead for sure. Number 3. Honey Badger There's a reason even lions try to avoid honey badgers. They are absolutely ruthless. Honey badgers can also adapt and make themselves at home in almost any environment. This honey badger ambushed the crocodile by jumping out of the reeds and catching it totally off guard. This honey badger has a dead crocodile in its mouth and is taking it somewhere so it can eat in peace without other animals annoying it. Number 2. Zebras Zebras are social animals, and they mostly spend their time together in herds, and this helps keep predators like crocodiles at bay. Most people don't know that zebras are far more aggressive than we give them credit for. There are many recorded accounts of zebras killing lions. These two zebras were out for a swim, enjoying the water, but the water is full of predators out to get them, and they have no idea, clearly. The crocodiles are after them, right behind them, and they're catching up, getting closer. The zebras do have one thing going for them, and that's the fact that they outnumber the crocodiles here. But by some miracle, they make it out of the water all right. No injuries or broken bones. That's good news, considering zebras have officially been labeled as an endangered species. Imagine having a nice cool drink in the watering hole, and then in a literal second you're fighting for your life against a vicious beast. This zebra doesn't have to imagine. Fortunately, the zebra survived the ordeal. Number 1. Other Crocodiles What makes this one even more gruesome is when you consider how there have been recorded cases of crocodiles not only killing but also eating each other. Yep, they practice cannibalism. 
These two crocodiles clearly have some unsolved differences. Look at the two beasts just going at it against each other. One of them grabs the other's tail in his mouth and then flips it over when it tries to leave. Nuh uh, buddy, you're not getting out of this one that easy. Let him go, let him go! No, I gotta stop, I gotta break it up. Wait. This croc just comes right behind the other one, and we already know it's up to no good. Alright, comment down below which of these crocodiles you think got it handed to them the worst. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Wildly for more. See you in the next one!